Alright, today we're going to demonstrate the Meadows Room for you. The name of the movement is coined by John Meadows, the Mountain Dog, and this movement primarily targets the upper back and helps for upper back development. So this is really going to target your rhomboids and your traps as your primary muscle groups, and it's also going to target your rear delts and your lats as secondary. Um, I really love this move for upper back development as a compound movement. I, like to start, I usually like to start my workouts out with this movement. So, uh, first we will discuss positioning. You're going to put a bar into the corner of a wall, and then you're going to align yourself with the bar. So what I do is I get my foot directly underneath the nose of the bar, so I about have the middle of my foot underneath the nose of the bar, and then I place my other foot just slightly forward of that foot, and about shoulder width apart. So, before I bend down and demonstrate this for you, uh, unlike most kind of rolling movements where you keep your elbow in tight to your body, this movement, in order to target those round points and upper back, we're going to actually have our elbow positioned away from our body. So you're going to be a little more extended at the shoulder. Um, so then we're going, to, we're going to bend down and you're going to brace yourself on your, your outside knee. We're going to grab the bar at the very end of the bar. Lift up. And one of the one of the tricky things to, to do here is instead of just being perfectly parallel to the ground, I actually pop the inside hip up. It gives you a little more range of motion and a little more stability throughout the movement. So here we go again. I'm gonna grab the bar, lift it up, and I pop that hip up so it's a little higher. And we're just going to row up right there. So notice I don't have my elbow in towards my body, but we're actually out. Let's come up here, you squeeze, hold it, let it back down. You don't need to twist and come back down, just bring it back to neutral and back up again. And that's how you do the Meadows Row. If you have any questions or comments, put them in the comment section below.